Hey guys, in this video, we're gonna talk about six different programming languages for you to learn for mobile app development. So let's go to number one, Swift. Swift was released in 2014, and it's a super modern and safe language for iOS app development. I think most iOS apps built today are gonna to be built using Swift, and it's actually like one of my favorite languages, and it's a pleasure to code in. Number two, Java. I think Java is still by far the most popular language in the entire world. It's just been around for so long and it's a great language to learn for Android development. I think most, I, uh, most Android apps are still built using Java, although the game is changing slowly. Number three, Kotlin. So Kotlin is the new language on the block for Android. It brings a lot of the safety and a lot of modernness to Android development and it's a great language for you to pick up if you're looking to start Android app development. Now number four, Objective-C. So Objective-C was the language of iOS apps up until 2014. All apps written before 2014 were written in Objective-C. So it's a great language to pick up, especially if you start working at a company that's a little older, they're guaranteed to have some Objective-C in their iOS code base. Number five, JavaScript. So JavaScript is sort of new to the app development world with the release of React Native. So web developers love this because they can bring some of their skills over from web development over to app development. Now React Native is still very new and things are still being worked out, but the future looks very, very promising for React Native and JavaScript in app development. Now lastly, number six. So the last language I wanna talk to you about today is called Dart. Dart is a modern language released by Google and is used in their framework called Flutter. Flutter promises to release both iOS and Android apps from one single code base, which is very exciting. The language is pretty easy to pick up, in my opinion, through just playing around with it. And I think it's a good addition to your arsenal of languages for mobile app development. If you guys wanna see a full breakdown and all these languages compared, head over to my website at zerotoappstore.com slash languages. Thanks for watching.